Hello, hello, hello. Good evening, good evening. Can you hear me? Hello, Miss. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Good evening, hello. welcome. Thank you so much for um, your cameras. Let's see, my goodness, we are 17. Let's see, let's wait for the rest. Okay, so do we have any new message, any new message uh, in the WhatsApp group today? I just see one about the attendance and about to be on time. Uh, but that's it, right? So, no nos han enviado ninguna información adicional. But anyway, right? So, you know what is our, um, the responsibilities that we have, right? Um, let's see. Let's start. Okay, Jorge Mauricio, how are you today? Jorge Mauricio, how you feel today? Jorge Mauricio, creo que no tiene, bueno, no creo que no sé qué pasó. Uh, let's see, let's see uh, Sandra Noemi. Sandra Noemi, tell us, how are you? How you feel? Uh, I am amazing. I feel amazing today. Feel ama amazing, right? Yes. Okay, perfect, nice. What about you, Carlos Adolfo? Evening, uh, my day is um, in the company we work hard today so i i feel i feel right now tired so much tired but it's a good day absolutely okay. good okay so you can say it is or it was right because i was the, okay if you are referring to something that it's already gone right but remember that the day it's not over so we are still in during the day right okay Thank you. Okay, but no problem, no problem. It, it's acceptable if you say the day is, okay? It's going nice because we still are on the day, right? Okay. Nice. Thank you. Let's see, let's see, no problem. Jocelyn, Tatiana, what about you, Jocelyn, Tatiana? How you feel today? Good evening, teacher. Uh, my day, uh... A more difficult and because in, in in my family I did I I want a parent and it's a more difficult. Okay, uh, your day it's a little difficult. Okay, because of family situations. I understood that you date. You... Okay. Okay. Nice. So let's see, Daniela Mercedes. What about you, Daniela Mercedes? Hi. How is your day going? It was good. It was good. I went to the university. I have practice of anatomy. So it was a good day for me okay nice it was nice okay so uh today is our friday right even though it's not friday but oh my goodness i was thinking that we don't have class tomorrow but we do <laughs> my god the thing is that normally right carlos adolfo normally the the course is just from monday to thursday right so i was thinking that we don't have class tomorrow but yeah we do my god. <laughs> oh my god todo el día pensé 
que hoy era el último día y yo andaba así como, ah, pero mañana no hay clase, ¿verdad? But I right now I just realized that, yeah, we do have class, my God. So, forget about the, 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 the uh, conversation that I was about to say, porque iba a decir que era jueves, pero con sabor a viernes, but now it's not, tomorrow it's Friday, so tomorrow we have class. So, nice, let's see, appreciate that you have full names, yeah, all of you are with a complete full name in the app. And that is nice. So yeah, we have class tomorrow, okay? So we have class tomorrow because of the vacation, right? So next week it is vacation, right? So I guess we are going to have the whole week from Monday to Friday. So um, that's why we need to have classes this coming tomorrow, right? It's Friday. And we are going to be on vacations from the 31st to the 4th. And we are going to continue with the classes on August the 7th, okay? So it will be one more time from a Monday to Friday, right? Yep, 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 yep. It is like that. Still, I guess we are going to miss one day because there are 16 but i don't know so right now it's uh let's keep it like that okay so nice let's start with the attendance but before to start with the attendance uh let's see uh luis miguel tell us uh what is uh, today date uh, okay today date is uh... Thursday, July 26th on 2023. Perfect, very nice. Okay, today is uh, Thursday, July the 27th, right? 27th, uh, 2023, okay? So let me uh, move on myself right here into the document for the attendance. And like always, please, um, let me know, right? Let me know if you are hitting the class. So this is the fourth class. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> okay, so Ana Cristina. Present teacher. Okay, nice. Thank you. Eh, veamos. Who's next? Uh, Briseida Janet. Present. Nice, Priscilla. Um, Carlos Adolfo. Present, Miss. Nice. Then we have Claudia Jesenia. Present, teacher. Nice. Um, Daniela Mercedes. Present, teacher. Nice. Um, Emanuel Efraín. Emanuel, parece que lo vi conectado. Uh, sorry, uh, good evening, ah, teacher, present. Yeah. Okay, yeah, you are there. <laughs> okay, nice. Uh, let's see, Evelyn Janet. Present. Nice, Evelyn. Um, then we have um, Flor de María. Flor de María. No. Eh, Freddy Alberto. Present, teacher. Thank you, Freddy. Um, then we have Glenda Lisette. Present, teacher. Nice, Glenda. Y Liana Mariel. Present, teacher. Nice, Iliana. Eh, Janessi Alexandra. Janessi hoy no ha venido. Present. Ah, ok. Nice. Ok, no problem, miss. Uh, Jefferson, Alexander. Jeffer no está, pero aquí. I'm wrong with his 
estoy escribiendo donde no es. Ok, so let's see, Genesi. We say yes, right? Then we have Jefferson, no. Uh, let's see, Jorge Mauricio. Present teacher. Thank you, mister. Uh, Jose Alberto. No. Jocelyn Tatiana. I'm here. Thank you, Jocelyn. Um, Juan Jose. I'm here, teacher. Good evening. Nice. Good evening. Welcome. Kevin Ariel. Kevin Ariel no vino ayer. Y ahora también. Uh, Luis Miguel, it's there. Teacher, I have a lot of problem with my computer. I don't know, you can hear me. Uh, yeah, Mauricio, what is the problem that you have? Go ahead, I don't know. Which is the problem? Creo que no sé si es el audio, pero bueno. So, uh, let's see, Luis Miguel is there. Uh, Rachel is there. Present teacher. Okay, Mr. Uh, Rebecca Paola. Present Miss. Nice, Paola. Uh, Ronald Rafael. Ronald, Ronald, no. Eh, Roxana Marisol, ahí está Roxana. Present teacher. Nice, Sandra Noemi. Present teacher. Nice, eh, Sara Verónica. Sara Verónica, no. Okay, so we are going to uh, validate the attendance uh, one more time at the end. So let's see, Jorge Mauricio. Now, uh, do you have the audio there? So wait, which is the problem that you have? I don't know, it was you? Yes, yes, I can hear you. Okay, so which is the problem? Now, I uh, now have the, the, the same problem again. I can, I can hear, I hear you. Okay, so you have uh, issues with your audio. So, but are you using the same uh, headsets or you are using different ones because the the other dates you work without any situation? I can I can hear you, teacher. Hear. Okay, so try to uh, see if you disconnect your headsets and turn it on and turn it back on and see if it works. Because I guess it's just, it's just you or probably can be your internet connection, okay? Remember that if we have issues with the internet, so se escucha como robotizado or sometimes we have some, some you know, audio, right? Audio problems, but uh, try to make sure, Mauricio, that you have, you know, the router working or you can restart the, the router to see if you have a better listening or a better audio. Okay, in this in this moment, boy, yes. Okay, no problem. Try to see if you are able to fix it because. ni con los audífonos puedo escuchar nada ni decir nada. Okay, okay, probably can be your your headsets, okay? So pueda que sean sus audífonos que está, que está utilizando, okay? Okay. Verifique ahí, cualquier cosa me puede escribir en el chat o me avisa, Mauricio, no hay problema, okay? Muchas gracias. No problem. So let's start where we stopped yesterday, right? Did you remember that we were about this, uh, we were about to complete this exercise, right? About the? Uh, WH questions with B. 
Did you remember what we mentioned about the WH questions? Did you remember something about the WH? Or no? No se acuerda. We mentioned details about these WH questions. So it cannot be answered with just a yes or no. Perfect. We mentioned, right? That <clears throat> sorry. Yeah, thank you. We mentioned that the difference between the yes no questions and the WH questions, one can be the answer, right? Because in a yes no question, the answer will be yes or no. Very simple, very short. But with it, when we have a WH question, we need to answer more deeply, right? More information that will be like a complete answer. So normally they are called information questions. They are called WH, but also information questions because the idea is that we are going to get details, okay? Nice, very nice. So there are more WH questions, okay, right here in the in the book, right here. Uh, we only have um, these ones like, like what, where, who, eh, and how, okay? But you know that there are more, right? There are more. Which ones did you remember? Que otras WH questions recuerdan? Whom and whose? Perfect, host. Uh -huh. When we are going to use host? Uh, I remember that we use whose when we refer to a, a possession. There you go, okay, yeah, whose, okay? You say whose uh, back is Oof. this, whose? uh the owner of this notebook okay so that will be possession right that will be denoting possession right that something or someone belongs to something else right nice also uh we have like the uh, how much in how many okay they are also considered as a wh question right how much how many Okay, so what else? Which, do you remember which? Yes. yes. Okay, when we are going to use which? To know uh, something. Mm -hmm. What else? Which? When when we have different options to there you go. Mm -hmm. Which that will be when we need to choose, okay, between two, three, four, five thousand actions, right? Which is your favorite color? Okay, there are many colors, and you need to choose which one do you prefer? Okay. Um go. which one do you prefer? Yeah, Luis Miguel, go ahead. Uh, I don't remember when we use whom. Okay, okay. So right now, if you see in the chat, I'm, I'm sending like a picture, right? Uh, about the WH questions. So we have the ones that we have here in the, in the manual, but also we have the other ones, the ones that we are talking about. Okay, so you, you are asking me, Luis, I'm sorry, for which one? For whom? W H O M. Teacher. Teacher. Uh, go ahead, Emanuel. Emanuel. Uh, it's correct to say uh, who's who is this car? Mm, who's the owner? Can be who's the owner of this car? Como quién es el dueño de este carro, right? Who's yes. the owner of this, lo que sea, right? Yeah, who's the owner? owner. Yeah, and that would be right. Thank you. So whom, that would be, for example, Luis Miguel, whom did he marry? So yo le digo a usted, whom did he marry? If I translate that, that would be con quien se casó él, right? 
So that will be for person, okay? It can be for a person and can be also uh, 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 for an object, okay? So let me see uh, some examples. How do we use whom, okay? It can be used for replace him or her, okay? Cuando yo me refiero a un él o a un ella, we can use whom, okay? So the, 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 the meaning that will be quien as well, right? So quien, but in this case, it's working like, um, no sé cómo decirles, that no, no trabaja tanto como una WH, aunque sí lo es, pero va más que todo enfocado a ser un objeto del verbo. Okay. Okay, it's, it's an object. But it is, it is a WH, okay? So, who or whom, okay? Nice. What else? How? We have it there. Creo que no, have, no tenemos problema, okay? Ahí le mandé una listita para que usted vea ahí algunos ejemplos y, y creo yo que eso es un repaso. O sea, esto ya, eh, ya, lo, ya lo tenemos, right? So, uh -huh. look at these examples. It says, like, the difference between who and whom, okay? So, it says, who knows the answer? The normal who, right? ¿Quién sabe la respuesta? Who knows the answer? But Hello, the... Jane. The other uh, one, sorry, yeah, Maurice. Uh, you, can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Very nice, very well. Okay, okay. Sorry. Perfect. Okay, now I guess you are fine, right? Okay, nice. Look at the other example with whom, okay? If I say, for example, uh, with whom do you want to work? Okay, so you see that we are using, like in this case, a preposition before the WH. Okay, con quien quiere trabajar usted? With whom do you want to work in this activity? Okay, so that is a WH question, but we are using Who's. whom instead of who. Yes, uh, Luis? I'm <clears throat> sorry, whom replace the object pronoun? There you go, that can be, can oh. replace, okay, the object, hey, okay? I, I got it. Nice, okay, perfect. Let's see the answers, okay? Esto ya lo hicimos, supuestamente, right? So let me see if I can make it bigger. Okay, number one. So let's see number one. Um, Emanuel Efraín, you are letter eight. And Freddy Alberto, B, letter B, okay? So go ahead, Emanuel and Freddy. Okay, uh, eight. Whom, who's, who's that? Oh, that's Miss West. Perfect, that is the example, right? Who's that? Okay, quien es? Okay, ese es como que yo diga, ay, quien es ese, right? Así, quien es? Oh, that's Miss West. Okay, number two. Uh, let's see, Janessi, you are letter eight. And uh, Juan Jose, you are letter B. Uh, mm -hmm. Where is she from? She's from Miami. Okay, so where, right? So where is, okay, or where's she from? Okay, she's from Miami. Ileana Mariel, number three, letter eight, and Ana Cristina, letter B, number three. And um, what is her first name? It's Celia. Okay, so what is or what's her first name? It's Celia, okay, nice. Uh, let's see, um, Luis Miguel, number four, letter eight. Um, four. Uh, Carlos Adolfo, letter B, please. Okay. Uh, who are the two students over there? Their names are Jeremy and Karen. Okay, who are the two students over there? Okay, their names are Jeremy and Karen. Nice.
Claudia Yesenia, number five, letter eight. Um, eh, Sandra Noemi, letter B. Where are they from? They they are from Vancouver, Canada. Okay, where are they from? Okay, so where? Okay, they are from Vancouver, Canada. Nice. And the last one, uh, Jorge Mauricio, number six, letter eight. And let's see. My goodness. Rachel Esther, letter B. Uh, what are they like? They are, sh they are shy, but very friendly. Okay, nice. Um, this is the question right about this describing how the person it is, right? Can be physically or can be feelings, right? They are shy, but very friendly, okay? So how, right? How? Or they like. Be careful. No se vaya a confundir que le esté preguntando que qué le gusta a ellos. No, right? So how they are means como son, right? Físicamente podría ser o, o de sentimientos, okay? Oh, they are very friendly. Um, or if it is like a lady, she is tall. She is thick, okay? She has curly hair. And, and that's the way that we describe. Okay, so let's continue. Okay, we have this part that says greetings around the world, but we are not going to stop that much on this. Okay, so we have different greetings. We use the handshake in the United States, a boat. So this is uh, where we use this. Which country? Japan. From Japan and uh, Korea. Korea. Okay, a kiss on the cheek. We use um, it right sometimes, but there is Spain. France. Okay, Spain can be a uh, hug. So El this is El Salvador to arrive in most of the countries and a pat on the back. Okay, so that is uh, that is another way that we can uh, greet someone, right? So that is nice. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see what else we have right here. What kind of greetings do we have in El Salvador? So normally we say hi, que ondas, right? So that's the typical one. Okay, we say que onda. Yo, yo, una, yo una palabra y el pesada. Okay, so uh, how is it going? Okay, how is it going? So we have this conversation between uh, soon he and Davey, okay? So I'm going to read the conversation just one time and then we are going to practice and we are going to create our own conversation. Says, uh, hey, Davey, how is it going? Fine, thanks. How are you? Pretty good. So are your classes interesting this semester? Yes, they are. I really love chemistry. Chemistry, no me voy a salir con chimestre, right? Chemistry, okay. So chemistry, are you and Beth in the same class? No, we aren't. My class is in the morning. Her class, it's in the afternoon. Listen, I am on my way to the cafeteria now. Are you free? Sure, let's go. Okay, so listen, uh, reading is important. Um, intonation okay we in spanish we don't really have inflections right so in spanish we have a flat language ya han escuchado esa palabra de flat yo le red digo flat. red flat uh -huh. yo solo yeah. en la música había escuchado eso de flat okay okay yeah but we say that in spanish we have a flat language, ok, el español es considerado como un lenguaje plano, o sea, nosotros en El Salvador, no estoy hablando del el español de, de origen español, ahí es diferente, they are very um, enthusiastic, right, when they are talking, but here in El Salvador, 
you say, I say, Javiera, que feliz estoy, right? But you don't sound really happy. So, es bien flat, es plano. Usted dice que está feliz de estar contento, pero no se escucha en su tono de voz. Usted escucha a un gringo, un nativo del idioma inglés, típico hasta en las películas. Oh, my God, right? So, they are very... <coughs> Uh, enthusiastic, right? When they are talking. And that's why English is very important and very interesting when you really add the, 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 uh, the for example, the um, exclamation marks. Okay? So, en español, ¿alguna vez usted ha escrito un, un signo de exclamación? Ni los usamos, right? So, we don't really use it, but in English, you will see Exclamations really common, right? Con, eh, the question mark. Usted en español está haciendo una pregunta, pero no suena pregunta. Hasta uno se responde solo porque no ha sonado como pregunta, right? So, mira vos y ya comiste. Esta vez estaban buenos, va. O sea, no suena como una question, but in English is different, okay? The intonation is very important, right? Respect the comma, the period, the space. So, that is very important, okay? Because if you read English like the way that we read Spanish, so it sounds Big different, right? Big different. So let's see, do we have new words right here? I guess no, but I don't know. So habrá alguna palabra aquí en esta conversación que le dé algún problema o que no la identifique? Yes, teacher. Um, Ajá, Emmanuel, go ahead. What is, what is mean uh, chemistry? Okay, so chemistry, uh -huh. chemistry. Chemistry. Yes. Química. Uh -huh. Okay, yeah. that is a school subject. So in this case, it's a university subject, right? Because they don't really look like uh, teenagers, right? They look like adults. So they are, um, that is a subject, okay? From university or from school, Emmanuel. Did you get the word subject? Uh. Uh -huh. Quedó igual. Uh, <laughs> no, no, okay. no. Okay, but like chemistry, it's like math, science, social okay. study, physical okay. education. Okay, so they are similar uh, subjects, right? So okay, when we it. are in the school, we have English as a subject, mathematics, okay. social study. What else? Physical education, science, okay? So, okay. Uh -huh. there, there you go, so chemistry. So, something else? Thank you. Teacher, uh, the word's pretty good. Is mm -hmm. um, the feeling good, but for more exclamation. Yeah, that is like emphasis, okay? Emphasis. Yeah, okay. If you translate it, it will be kind of kind of the same, okay? Como que yo le diga, very good. Muy bien. But pretty good, it's more than very good, okay? It's a little bit more, okay? Más okay. que bueno, okay? Excelentemente bien, right? The similar of amazing? Can be. Can be okay, okay. Can be amazing, wonderful. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty okay. good. Okay. Nice. Thank you. Okay. No problem. No problem. Uh, let's see. Daniela Mercedes, you will be soon he. And uh, let's see. Freddy, Alberto, yes. please be Davey. Go ahead. Hey David, how's it going? Hi, thanks. How are you? Pretty good. So, are your classes interesting this semester? Yes, they are. I really love chemistry. Chemistry? Are you and Beth in the same class? No, we aren't. My class is in the morning. Her class is in the afternoon. 
Listen, I'm on my way to the cafe cafe cafeteria now. Are you free? Sure, let's go. Okay, perfect, perfect, nice. So now what we are going to do, we are going to create our own conversation. So this conversation is just a model, okay? So, but it's not necessary to follow exactly the same. So remember that this is a conversation between two, but we are going to be four or five in the group and we need to talk all the participants, right? So we are going to create a conversation, okay? Listen to the, the instruction, okay? So we are going to include yes, no questions, but also we need the WH questions, okay? For example, we can start the conversation like, um, hi, Mr. Um, Carlos. How are you? Oh, empieza, Mr. Carlos. I'm very nice. What about you? Ah, I'm pretty good. I'm hitting the class, okay? So, and then viene uh, Carlos and says, look, she's my classmate, okay? Her name is Sandra. Oh, nice to meet you, Sandra. It's nice to be in the same class, okay? So, uh, tell me, Sandra, what is your first name or what is your last name? Oh, my last name is and blah, blah, blah. But look, uh, also we have Luis Miguel. He is also my friend, okay? So, and then you start including all the participants in the conversation, right? At the end, you need to say something, right? No se vale decir, no es que yo soy el que escribo, nada más. No, right? So we need to say something in the conversation, okay? And write it down. You decide in the group if all of you will be writing down or just one person. And then please send it into the WhatsApp group, okay? No se complique, okay? You can write it down in your notebook, take a picture and send it, okay? Ahora, si usted la quiere escribir y enviarla escrita ahí como un texto, it's fine, okay? Pero lo que se les haga más fácil, because remember that we have like five minutes only, okay? No es que tiene una hora usted para hacer la conversación. Tiene cinco minutos para armarla, practicarla y enviarla, okay? So remember, include WH questions and yes, no questions. That means using the verb be. So are we clear with the instruction? Yeah? No? Yes. Okay, so you are going to send just one conversation per group. No me vaya a mandar todos una conversación. No, it's just one per group, okay? So I'm going to create four groups, okay? So van a quedar four groups. Quedan um, todos de cinco. Oh, no, dos de cinco. No, tres de cinco y dos, uno de seis, okay? So just one group will be from six. Eh, quiero ver, ese creo que quedo yo. Ajá, yeah, okay. So uh, please, as soon as we start the, the groups, start working, okay? No hay tiempo para, eh, quiero ver, y usted, compañero, ¿cómo le ha ido en la vida? No, right, there is no time for that, okay? So as soon as we write the group, so classmates, who wants to start? What will be the first question? So who will be joining the conversation? Who will be writing down everything? And who will send it into the WhatsApp group, okay? So in five minutes, I need to see the conversation in the group, okay? In the WhatsApp group. Okay, so we have five minutes only. Okay, so let's do that right now, please.
Flor de María Sánchez. Hello, 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 Flor de Maria, Flor de Maria.
Okay. Um, welcome, welcome back. Okay. So I give you more time because um, I was, you know, in the groups. Y había ahí un grupito que, que estaba ahí todavía finalizando. Okay. So, but, but that's nice. Okay. That's nice. So, and I received just two messages. Y como que hubo un grupo ahí, no sé, a los que yo me metí estaban organizando, but I don't know which one. Okay. Um, no sé, ¿cómo les fue? Creo que éramos nosotros, pero ya, ya envié la conversación ahí. Okay, so remember the idea was create a conversation, okay? So create a conversation um, and try to, to, to include WH questions, yes, no questions, and all the participants, right? All the participants. So let's see. Espero que se acuerde con quien trabajó. Bueno, yo lo puedo ver aquí. Quiero ver. So let's see. Uh, group number one, it says Daniela, Emanuel, Freddy, Luis Miguel, and Roxanne. So go ahead with your conversation, okay? So, si no la anotaron, creo que si la mandaron ahí puede ver en el grupo, right? So go ahead with your conversation. Uh, okay, I, I'm going to start with Daniela. Okay. Hi. Hello, Daniela. How are you? Hello, Luis. I'm fine. How about you? Uh, I'm really, really preoccupied because I have a lot of homework at the university and I don't know how I can finish. And you? Oh, um, how are you? Well, it was a good day, but I have a lot of homework too from my, my university. So I think I will work the entire night. Oh, well, we have a difficult day. And what happened with you, Freddy? How was your day? Um, very fine, thanks. Uh, this day is uh, very occupied. And uh, what about you, Emmanuel? Uh -huh. Next. What about you, Emmanuel? Efraín? Uh, I don't know what happened with Efraín. Emmanuel, so activate oh, your Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yeah, Go yeah, ahead. yeah. Uh, I was just very, very good my my, my day because uh, uh, I was very bossy. Uh, I know very people. Uh, I went to Metapan City. I was very, very good. Oh, really? Okay. Did you eat uh, some typical food by Metapan? Uh, the cheese, I cream too. Um, also, uh, tostecas. Very, very, very delicious. Uh, sounds delicious. Yes. Uh, Roxana. Do you know who is Roxana? Sorry? Do you know who is Roxana? Yes. Uh, yeah. Our classmate. Oh, yeah. sorry. It's a new classmate. Yeah. Hi, Roxana. Hi. Roxana, where do you live? Hi. Uh, I live in Concepcion. Chalatenango. 
Yes. I live to or uh, today. I don't understand. Eh, estuve cerca de Nueva Concepción ahora. Okay, you were, you were really close, really close. That would be near. Close, close. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. I close to Nueva Concepción today. Really? Yes. I went to Metapan too. Okay, so I don't know if you complete your conversation, that it's nice. Remember, uh, the idea is use WH questions, right? Who, what, who's, which, where, uh, how much, how many, okay? And then um, just no questions. Are you, it's he, um, am I, right? So that's the idea, okay? So my goodness. Time is running so fast, but we still have the other two conversations, right? Well, three, they enviaron dos, pero so deberían de ser cuatro, right? So um, we are going to stop for a while because of the time, right? But tomorrow we can continue, okay? We are going to continue and we are going to move on, in, in, move on I'm sorry, into the next topic, okay? So for today, we keep Burby, and WH questions, okay? okay? So if you have questions or you have doubts, so please try to clarify, right? Because that is like a review of previous knowledge, okay? So tomorrow we are going to start with the new, uh, the new topic that we have in the book, okay? So today it's the last day for the first week, right? Remember I told you that uh, every four classes we finish a uh, week, okay? So today at midnight, so we need to make sure that we have complete ex uh, um, exercise one and two in the platform, right? Eso ya se había dicho desde el día uno. En teoría usted ahora a la medianoche tiene que tener completa la sección uno y la sección dos de la plataforma y mañana iniciar la sección tres, okay? So, um, like always, I need to validate the attendance, but I will mention just the ones that do not have uh, attendance yet. Please let me know if you are here. Flor de Maria Sanchez. Teacher. Uh, yes, go ahead. Eh, yo tuve un eh, problema eh, en, en unas eh, lecciones que las Repasé y la vi y me da siempre mal. Ok, I understand, Emanuel. Try to send, send me a message, ok? Mándeme el número del ejercicio para poderle ayudar. Ahí a mí también. Sí. Que en la parte de arriba, ahí dice ejercicio 1.9, 1.14, Escríbame y dígame, mire, tengo problema en el ejercicio... 2.9, un ejemplo, o 2.1. Y yo lo Ese verifico creo. y le ayudo con gusto. Igual, Rachel, si tiene problema, mándenme ahí un mensajito, pero díganme en qué ejercicio es y de qué grupo es. Porque acuérdense que tengo otros grupos y a veces solo me dicen, Miriam, ayúdenme en un ejercicio de la plataforma, pero ¿cuál? ¿Y de cuál grupo? Porque tengo varios. Entonces, eh, de, ¿qué no grupo todos, somos? Dicho? Nosotros Dos. somos pre-intermedio 1. Okay. Pre intermedio uno. Okay. So, uh, please. Okay. Send her that info and I will help you. So, let's see. Jefferson Alexander, it's here. No está Jefferson. Uh, Jose Alberto. Kevin Ariel. Ronald Rafael. Sara Verónica. Bien. My goodness, we have many absence, but bueno, no está, no está. So time is over. I appreciate your time, Em. Uh, please don't forget that we have classes tomorrow, okay? Okay. Ni modo, hasta las nueve que termine la clase se va de parranda, porque los viernes sé que es de parranda, ¿verdad? Para <laughs> muchos, pero mi modo. We have class, so as soon as we finish the class, so ya esté listo solo para terminar la clase y salir, ¿verdad? Okay, so bye bye, good night, take care, and see good you night. tomorrow, see okay? You. Bye bye. 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 bye.
Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Have a nice, uh, good night. Mm -hmm.